Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to the channel. My name is Duena and thank you so much for joining me. Now on today's episode of things that I did not need but I purchased anyway. Guys, this stuff I'm so late, so behind to the game. My apologies. This stuff will I'll be showing you candles that I got for candle day sale and then be just showing you some other stuff that I picked up right around that time. So all of this stuff is pretty old. I've just been sitting on it. But yeah, this would be my actual last haul of the year. So without further ado, let's get right into this video because I got several to shoot. But yeah, okay, let's get all the candles out of the way. You're going to think I'm a psycho. I may be to some extent because this is ridiculous. But hopefully for New Year's, I don't believe in New Year's resolution. I just don't. I don't know, leave me a comment if you believe in still that. I do believe in changing, but I don't believe in New Year's resolution. Yeah, but I am going to, hopefully this will be my last candle haul because I don't need any more candles. I'm set for almost two years. But hey, if I see four, I'll probably show you on another video though. But if I see the four, I will repurchase those. But anything else, I won't repurchase. So let's get right up into what I got for candle day sale now the first one i got is this peppermint sugar cookie i don't know why i was thinking it was mir uh, mary C cookie mary cookie i didn't like that one it was in a blue my bad i ended up getting four of these i told you i really don't like scents that smell like baking goods but this right here it actually smelled like a peppermint cookie or some chocolate in peppermint this smells so good. It puts you in the mind of peppermint bark, the candle. But this is really good. I don't know this year I've actually been into like mint smells. I don't know what's going on. And normally I steer from those, but I've been gravitating to the mint stuff. I don't know. I keep looking like some stink. It ain't. Yeah, I picked up two of the uh, Palo Santo and Sage. This is, I'm getting lipstick all on the um, candle wax. This right here is a very soft scent. So probably when you burn it, you probably won't even smell it because it's just that subtle. So I don't know about that one. Then I picked up two of the coffee and whiskey. Now these are not my jam, so I'm not even going to smell it because they are a gift for somebody. So, and then the leather and brandy. I picked up two of those. These are actually gifts. So I'm not going to smell because they're not my jam. So picked up two of those. And then I it, I told you, look crazy. I end up picking up seven of the Frozen Lake. <clears throat> when I first got into Bath and Body Works candles, these were like my go-to. Still is. I adore them. I don't think I will ever stop burning those. And you only need to burn... I know people like to burn two and three candles at a time throughout the house, but I'm telling you with that scent, you just need the one because it's that strong. So if you're not into strong candles, don't even look at that one. Don't even. And then I ended up picking up seven of the marshmallow fireside. I wish they had better packaging. I hate the packaging. I wish they would really bring back like a matte because they had it in matte gray. I love that packaging. And they had the frozen lake in a matte bluish color i love that because it was just it blended so i but i love the candle so and i just got it i love 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 it. this actually feel like you should be in front of a fireplace i don't know this what that scent gives me so yes for candle day sale i did end up getting 24 candles in all and on that same day i ended up going to TJ Maxx. Me and Koya was in TJ Maxx. Was it TJ Maxx? I believe so. Let me look and see where these candles come from. Yeah, we went to TJ Maxx. I ended up picking up two of the Autumn Nights only because they were $2 and they do smell like a little hint of a fireplace. So it smells really good. And then when the girl said, yeah, she'll give them to me for $2 because they had no price. I was like, I'll take. So I ended up getting two of these. And then, what else I got? I ended up getting the silver spruce. This candle is really good. I wish they had a bigger candle. 
and this I love like that um the metallic I don't know if I'm blinding you with it it smells like Christmas that's all I can say about that one but this one actually smells like Christmas so if they only had the one and then I ended up picking up a peppermint bark and I love the metallic red on this one and it smells really good too oh my god smell like you want to eat it oh I forgot to show you what I got with lotions from Bath and Body Works I ended up picking up I think two of the leather and brandy even though they were free because I had some coupons for some free ones and then I ended up picking up two I'm telling you I had coupons and I don't know how they lasted to that but they did and it worked out for me well I had them in my um I had like three free ones in the app so and then I had one paper coupon so that's how I was able to get them and I ended up picking up three of those these are OG I told you we go back like a fan so yeah and then I ended up was in home goods through that week found some other stuff girl did not need any of this but I purchased it I picked up just one of the holidays no this still came from TJ Maxx my bad and this other one too but Christmas holiday spice that's what it smells like but I like the packaging though that's the only reason why I got it because this is very cinnamon 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 this is very that so hopefully that don't be too overpowering when you burning it. And I told you, I love cinnamon gum. Oh, that's like one of my favorites, but I can't chew it because it uh, cut the side of my mouth. So I don't touch. What do you mean? I, I had another. I had like, hold on, hold on, hold on. Where did that one come to it? Oh, chat. And then I had Christmas tree. So. Yeah, that smell. That smell good too. So, yes. And then from Bath and Body Works, I forgot. The little plug-in, I needed two more of those. So I ended up getting two. And what else? Okay, so I was in Home Goods like the two weeks later. And I ended up picking up some more candles. So, Seaside Holiday. I wish I could have found this candle way sooner and I wish I could have found like four of them. This smells so good. It reminds me of that sea salt lavender candle that I have. Oh, this is a very good candle and I hope it burns like that too. But these were, why? Okay, those candles from Bath and Body Works, of course, you know, they were $9.95 for candle day sale. And then the little ones were $7.99. And then this one was, don't know why, $12.99. But it smells so good, though. Oh, come on. I don't have no room for it. And then still home goods, I got the Silver Snowflake. A very minty, clean smell. I ended up getting two of these. And then the Shimmering Snow. I just like the packaging on them. And then they smell pretty good. And I ended up getting two of those. And then I ended up getting two of Season Greetings. And they were $7.99. So. And I don't know what it is this year. I'm into met uh, metallics. And this one smell good. It, also, it almost smelled like a hair product. And no, I'm not getting sick on smell. Because <laughs> I know some people, you can't smell a whole lot. They tend to get sick. But hey, and then I picked up, I have been wanting this, this scent for the longest. And every time I would smell it, I would never get it. And then, you know, Home Goods always have it for $12.99. But I ended up, I think I TJ Maxx for $9.99. And that was the only reason why I got it. It's just a lemon kitchen scent. I don't know why I got this. Cause, <laughs> just got the one. But yeah, my lips look so orange. I hate this color. And that's that Fenty that red it's not giving what I needed to give okay so this store my mom had to get her license renewed and so I was like okay I'll take you so we went and I don't go into the beauty supply stores anymore I just don't because I don't wear like wigs and stuff 
and I don't rarely get braids. And then plus, I am getting braids soon, soon though, but I still have so much on hand. So I really don't go into beauty supply stores, but they had this one store, I guess they was turning into one of those little hood clothing. You know how the stuff be out on the mannequins, just looking cheap, tacky, and trashy. It does, if you like shopping out, hey, this is my opinion, I don't shop there, but baby, when um, I went in there, cause they had furniture in there too. So I was like, well, maybe I can find a odd piece, but no, they didn't. But baby, don't talk about my coat. But when I saw Shaggy, I had to have, it was $45.99 or $49.99. And I was like, it's a medium. And baby, it's a little tight around my arms, but hey, it still works. But the girl was like, yes, it's $25. And I was like, oh, let me see if I can get this. So here I am undressing in the store. Baby, I made this coat work, honey. I don't even know why I put this. Of course, you know, it's so tight because of the hoodie. Let me model for y'all. Girl, I feel like I'm in New York City, honey. <laughs> you see her? She reminds me of one of those little shaggy dogs. I had to get her. And for $25, I was like, oh, yeah, you coming home. So that was a steal, I thought. But, yes. So I ended up getting that. And then also... For that Black Friday, I don't do Black Friday sales at all. When I say I do not do Black Friday, but I went into Kirkland's when it was that was it Saturday or Sunday because I had to take something back, I think, to Ross. And I was like, why? But I was heading to my mom, so I just stopped by. So went into Kirkland's and they still had their Black Friday sale where everything was additional, still 30%, and then plus 20%. So not really 50, but still 50. So you got the 30 and then you got the 20. So I ended up getting eight of these. They're tall too. And the only reason why I got eight, they were $9.99, is because I want to put these in a vase to make it like real full. And then I only paid $4 for them. So you couldn't beat that. So I ended up doing that. So yeah, did I get eight or nine? One of them, child. And I ended up getting two of the wax melts. So two, what is this, peppermint? I told you, I don't know what it, what it is this year about mint. Normally I'm not into mint, but this year I am. So peppermint and creamy vanilla, I ended up getting two of those. And then I ended up getting two of the crisp air and citrus. So, and they smell pretty good. And then, why they had this on clearance, this bowl? Let me put that down. I was like, let me get it. Girl, only $20. I could not leave this behind. They only had the one. I was like, oh, I got to, I may have to put a close up on the side. Baby, I love that. And look how big it is compared to my head. So for $20, got it. Oh, he's going to keep texting, child. Ignore. So the stuff that I got, oh, and my husband, when he was here, because he was here for um, Thanksgiving, he surprised me with, I told him I wanted this fragrance. Goddess by Burberry. This smells so good, but it is so pricey. The smaller bottle was like $128 or 125 one of them. And then the bigger bottle is like 168 but I love a good gift set because you get the extra little travel. So this was 175 and girl, this smells so good. If you ever get a chance to smell it, please do. And I think I'm a, um, oh, it's so good. I think I, um, and yeah, I've wore it before, so that's why I can smell it. I think I'm gonna do a video on my favorite top five maybe fragrance so that may be a video that that'll be coming soon so i ended up getting that and then this stuff that i got from rose all like within the same time frame like within two weeks i've just been sitting on this stuff so hey it's old child tell me why this nutcracker he this rose he just had to come on with me i don't know why because i'm not into christmas decor but when i saw him and he 
real wood. He's heavy. And for $21.99, maybe I'm going to start collecting nutcrackers. I don't want to go out with the Christmas trees and all that heavy stuff. Mm -mm. I don't want all that. I want subtle. And he is a nice little placeholder. So I ended up getting him from that. And then I ended up getting this um, by Philosophy. This Citron and Sage. Girl, this soap smells so good. Normally, I wouldn't look at their brands and Ross because they're like $10.99 a pop. He is really getting on my nerves. Girl, my husband, he being stupid, he'll text one letter at a time. He's going to keep doing it too. He's just trifling. He's going to text one letter at a time and spell the word out. Ignore that. I know it's hard, <laughs> but please try. So, yeah. But I like the scent. So, yeah. Okay, I'm going to show you this next piece from Ross. And then we done with Ross. But I'm like, don't judge me. Please don't judge me. I'll judge you back. Why did I... If she looks so cheap, I promise you do. And she really does. But I was like, I don't know why I had to have her. And she was $15. She, <laughs> I don't know. So I'm going to put her on a... And she's heavy. But I am going... You know, uh, with the Emmys, she looked like that. She's giving me that vibes. Or what's the little tin little robot that was on um, Star Wars? Was it Star Wars? Jedi? One of them, you know, the little gold one. <laughs> That's what it's giving, giving off. But I thought she was too cute, though. So I'm going to see if she'll blend, not blend in, but if she'll blend in. She's giving me more metallic. That's the only reason why I picked her up because the gold wasn't golding. It's gold, but I just still think she is an Emmy. <laughs> sure. And then this next thing that I got from TJ Maxx, I'm all over the place, was this little, I'm trying not to blind. Okay, this little painting I thought was cute for $17. So I don't know if I'm going to keep, because if I can't find a spot for her, I think I got another week before it hit 30 days. So this got to go back. I don't know, but I like her. I like the drawing. Okay, the next four things that I got from Home Goods, I told you Home Goods really ain't did it for me this year. What they normally this is the best time I find my Home Goods items. But this year, they ain't have, whew. Christmas took over home goods this year. It was like Christmas land. So, mm-mm. Okay. This little thing right here, the only reason why I picked it up is a marble piece. And it's just like a little, something that you can store stuff in. It's not a candle. You just take the top off. But this is going back because I don't even know why I got it. I got enough catch-all stuff. But I thought that was too cute. Like that color. So I may end up taking that back. I don't know. What y'all think? I need to know. <laughs> Within a week. Okay. And then this next piece of these ramekins. And I needed them. They look, the only reason why I picked these up because they look like stoneware. And I thought that was like a very good deal. And they were $6.99. But love these. The next item I got is this throw. Now, I don't need another throw. But that color. I don't know what it is. I'm, I'm feeling it, though. And this was $19.99. And if I don't keep it, it'll be a gift to somebody. So... I had to have and it's got the little tassels so I thought that was cute within itself and then the last item that I got from I'm finna say Goodwill child why I ain't been a Goodwill yeah whoo the last time since I got that table but this last ah my goodness this catch-all tray I think this is soapstone it's gotta be because it's not or this could be marble. It's either marble or soapstone. It's heavy. It's, whew. I paid $30 for this. This was made in Pakistan. But girl, can you see? 
the details. That chocolate brown is mm, so good. So yeah, but I like that too. But uh, do I really need? Do I really need this though? I believe this one going back because I. I don't know. Okay, guys. Like I said, I hope you guys' Thanksgiving was great. You spent time with your family, got caught up with the old cousins, played with Unc for a little bit, talked trash with TT. So I hope you guys had a good holiday. But yeah, so Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. So guys, I cannot wait for the new year to come around. It's going to be good. It is literally going to be good. But I think after this video, you're going to see my favorites for home goods and then my favorites for just random stores. So yeah, I wanna get that out of the way right before the new year and then I wanna get right down into the new years because a lot is going to happen if God willing and I'm here to see it, it's going to be a good year. I just know it, it's going to be a good year. So you guys take care of yourself. Thanks for watching. And as always, before you leave, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I will catch you on the next video and I'm out.